Yo, 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 yo. This is the Over You main bass. Let's take a quick listen here. <laughs> So uh, let's let's get into it. Right off the bat, I'm starting with this FM Square 3 wavetable from uh, Virtual Riot's pack. If you haven't got this, you could also import a image into the wavetable here of um, just some like black and white intersecting lines or something, just so you can get this kind of weird squarey effect going on. But basically what I've done is I've taken LFO1, set it to envelope at a quarter note rate, uh, and I've modulated the wavetable position quite a bit just so there's some movement and the pulse width modulation uh, about 10 or so, uh, just to give it a little bit of movement at the onset of the sound. And then from there, I added a uh, comb minus filter using LFO1 again. I modulated the filter cutoff up by like about three or so. So you get kind of this sound. Uh, there is some automation playing right now, so it is moving the cutoff filter. I'll get into that a little bit later. Uh, next thing I did was I took LFO2. Uh, it's the same exact thing. I just had it a little bit tighter, and this is just controlling the level of FM square 3. It's that quarter note. It's envelope. Um, next, we get into the effects. So I added a hyper dimension. I used LFO1 to modulate the hyper a little bit, just a little bit of width. And then I used the size under dimension, put it about 25%, and the mix about 14%, just to give it a little bit of width. Is it with it? In here just a little bit of width and under the distortion here i modulated from about 38 percent to added about 42 or so kind of helps bring out some harmonics makes it sound a little more full so here's it without here's it with once again kind of subtle but you know help fill out the sound a little bit uh then from there i added a uh, multi-band compressor i don't think i touched it very much other than just pulled up the makeup gain uh here's what that sounds like and then lastly, I just added an EQ and I used LFO1 um, to pull up a high pass filter uh, and then move a band down from 20K, probably down to around 1K or so in the middle of the uh, window here. Uh, they, they both uh, modulate in towards the window. So that happens on the onside of the note uh, using LFO1. So that's what, here's what this sounds like. <laughs> Once again, just a little bit of movement helps fill up the sound a little bit. Um, and that's pretty much most of the sound. Uh, the post-processing isn't too, nothing crazy going on. So I used an EQ to clean up the low end because uh, I added a sub underneath. Uh, I used a bit warmer, which is a saturation preset. Uh, just a little bit, just to add some more harmonic. Uh, an OTT to help balance the frequency spectrum. I used it at 100%. Here's without an OTT and with an OTT. So just without. <laughs> And once again, another EQ to help clean up the low end from the OTT and saturation. And then I tamed the highs a little bit. It was a little bright, around 10K. And I also low passed it about uh, 18, 19K. And then this is, then from here I did uh, some reverb modulation. So I've got a fairly long reverb here, about four seconds, fairly upper mid rangey. And then I just automated the dry wet at the end of like phrases just to get like a reverb throw. You can hear it like ramps up in like, Gains all this like room sound, sounds super far away. Uh, last thing I did here uh, was I automated the filter cutoff uh, in Serum. So if you go to your comb minus filter, you can see the cutoff. So I clicked it, brought up the lane for that, and then I automated it uh, to get the cool bends and change the pitch of the uh, ringing bass here. We have a straight tone, and then here it slightly automates up. So. You can kind of automate all this. And you just mess around and try to create some cool stuff. You could just as easily make a VIP. Hope you found this helpful. Uh, if you did, make sure you leave a, a like and a comment. Thanks. Follow your boy on Instagram and Twitter at, at This is Cyclops and SoundCloud at Official Cyclops so you can see dumb memes and bad music.